How's it? <laughs> Sorry, it just <laughs> happened. <laughs> how's it going? This is Lane. Hey, man, how's it going? This is not Lane. Right, double, how's it going? Yeah. That's double the goings. Getting back in the groove, my man. Double the house? So while you were. Yeah, while well, I was gone. While you were PAX. setting up. Oh, no, hold on. <laughs> I figured something out while you were screwing around. What do you think? It looks like he's just got really short legs. He tries to do the idle animation. <laughs> oh, really stretching his legs up there. Anyway, yeah. that's the only reason I switched into that outfit. We're back. We're back, though. Yep. We figured out a few things. And we're one less Christian, so. That sounds so brutal. <laughs> Why am I trying to get on this? There's no reason. Except for that. Get to ride around and now you have to test grip. Yeah, like, I'm... I've got nowhere to go with this, though. And I got bats flying around. If I had the double claw shot, <laughs> I'd be in business right now. All right. Get out of here. Get get out get out of my face. What? You thought he would... You would think he'd grab the ledge. You'd think. <laughs> Watch this. Freaking not grabbing the ledge. Watch this. Hold on. Okay. <laughs> I just did that and he grabbed the ledge, but I guess he wasn't feeling it that time. We're just gonna casually... Hey, what was that weird jump cut you just saw? That was strange! What a strange... <laughs> oh, man. So you said you went to PAX, eh? I did go to PAX. I don't know. Oh, please. But he'll grab there. On I'm, a shaky I'll take thing. it. I'll yeah. freaking take it. <laughs> Anyhow. Yeah, I went to PAX. It was, it was dope. Ran into Dunky. Donkey. Hey, he was really cool. And uh, in the line going in to get your bags checked and all that, uh, I ran into Angry Joe and got yeah. a picture with him, so that was pretty fun. That's pretty cool. It sounds like it was awesome. And you said it was here uh, in it was Texas, down right? in San Antonio, Texas. No? I'm jealous. Yeah, it was pretty sweet. I'm sad that you didn't, like, verify that there were some roosters. I'm sure there were, but, like, some rooster teeth. Dude. Actually... On Saturday, when everybody was there, it was really hard to find anyone. <laughs> there was a lot of people. Yeah, imagine. <laughs> imagine. Ran into a guy who nailed the Kingdom Hearts Cloud uh, cosplay. Oh, yeah. Down, like, to, down to even the claws on the left hand. It's pretty sweet. It's a, it's a good thing that you got to that point in the game. Yeah, <laughs> to like where we, I could recognize it and so well. Because it was fresh in my mind. When I saw yeah. him, I thought, oh, Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> I think we li we literally played that the day before, like you saw that, yep. the day before you left, so. Because I remember Cloud getting stomped. Oh, by, yeah. <laughs> by Cerberus. That was pretty good. Yeah. What? So what is it you're doing down here? Uh, Do you know what you're doing? No. I'm just swimming. I'm pretty sure I just need a key, and then we're done with this dungeon almost. Oh, hey. It looks like a water bomb. That looks like a bomb. Oh, of you water. got someone showing up. Oh, you got a water bomb showing what? up. <laughs> I forgot they were in here. That's <laughs> awesome. Come on, take care of it. You got it. I believe in you. Oh, are you talking to me? No, the bomb. Uh oh. I don't need you in here. There's one way for the water bombs to show up. Right? Oh, always oh, after me. Ah! Uh -huh. <laughs> <It's slow. laughs> That was, that was amazing. Even though physics-wise, your feet would go first. Nah. This is Zelda. What's physics? What's physics? So I guess that's just so you don't get stuck in the dungeon. They have those water bomb on. Cause I don't... Yeah, I guess. So you don't have to backtrack eons. I wish that would have... Ah! Wish it would have been at the front gate. Yeah. <laughs> front gate, except... You can claw shot down here, by the way. Oh, can you kill them with claw shot? Oh, I just took out its heart. That's pretty brutal. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh, they're all dead now. I don't know why you told me that. All these poor things are dying. Now. I like how you can do it with your feet not having to be grounded. Yeah. Me too. <gasps> I'm me loving too. this game even more now. Yeah, this temple's fun when we're actually to the fun parts of the temple and not the boring part. Oh, dude, now, now that we're here, I can fully talk about those panels that were horrible. <laughs> 
Oh yeah. 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 Oh no. Oh, run. <laughs> yeah. You. So while we were down there, the first day there was a Psychology of the Legend of Zelda franchise uh, panel, led by, I believe, all of them were psychologists and one was a psych student, like pretty psyched out student. <laughs> I'll see myself at the door. Um, <clears throat> nice gyro you got going on. Yeah, there. I'm just going to use the gyro because it's faster. Yeah. So I thought that the psych panel was kind of annoying a little bit because it seemed like it really seemed like all they played was Breath of the Wild. And I thought, well, I thought you said, well, well, hold on. That was the Ocarina panel. Okay. These are pretty similar. They get kind of confusing. Anywho. <laughs> <laughs> I see what's happening. I didn't know what happened to me the first time. So the psych panel, they, they talked about some other stuff, but the way they talked, it seemed like all they played was Breath of the Wild. And Scrubs? All the stuff they pulled, it seems like everything they talked about and said was just ripped from Matt Pats and PBGs. Uh, like when they brought up Majora's Mask in the five stages of grief. They mm -hmm. ended up saying it, but everything they were saying was just pulled from that video. Okay. And then... Oh, so they were they were kind of talking about what Matt Pat was actually talking about there in the game? Yeah, game? and then they gave Matt Pat and PBG credit. But oh, I thought, cool. can you give me an another insight? It was a lot of information that it seemed like they just did a YouTube search. Or, you know, I mean, they did dive further into it. And they had some different aspects. But I feel like I just... As much as I've already learned from YouTube, I didn't get a whole lot extra, but they, they did pretty all right. At the time, I was kind of annoyed because I was falling asleep in the chair because it was a long day. We had just drove in the night before, and it was just a whole mess. I was exhausted. So, yep. it, in the end, that wasn't too bad because I was thinking, oh, man, I hope the Ocarina panel is killer. Yeah. And that was on the last day, and we were going to do that panel before we left. And so... What is this panel like? This Ocarina panel, what was it trying to be? Just a panel about... Ocarina and how it affected games and stuff. Okay. Because it was Ocarina 20 years and counting and how it affected the gaming industry and all that. Ouch. And the thing is, it seemed pretty promising first going in there because three out of the four panelists were all people um, w that... I'm sure that one of them 100% said this, but they all seem this way, but like they were there for midnight release of Ocarina for the N64 and remember playing it and all this and the other. I was like, well, all right, well, sweet. They're pretty well qualified because, I mean, Ocarina is the earliest game I remember playing. I played it like when it came out, but I was like three years old. <laughs> I remember running around in circles thinking, this is the coolest thing ever. <laughs> yeah. Um... So they have better recollection of when that thing first came out than I do. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so I thought, sweet, it'd be cool to hear their aspect on it. But the fourth panelist... Here it goes. 16-year-old, <laughs> who the first time playing Ocarina was on the Wii U Virtual Console. And frickin' let's say fast forward, but rewind a million episodes back to where I was giving Lane a hard time about playing <laughs> Ocarina on... The GameCube, I I, I pretty much re-preview <laughs> yeah. all that because this guy was on a panel and he played it on Wii U and he didn't, it looked like that was the first panel he ever did. He kept forgetting to talk into the mic and he stumbled Classic. over his words. It was annoying, but I had to cut him some slack because I don't want to be, you know, I don't want to be too mean to the guy, but it was after a while that <clears throat> it was just kind of cringe city. You're gonna have to lower down. <laughs> ah, I was like, I, I have no idea what to do now. I'm so lost. And then you said that, and I was like, a door is open. Um, it was at the point, I just, I felt the generation gap between me and this guy. And when he said, it came to the point where he goes, it was bomb lit dope, as the kids might say. I got up, <laughs> grabbed my bag, and left <laughs> Sam and John there, and there was still 20 minutes left in the panel. <laughs> it's bomb lit dope. And okay. at that point, I was like, I'm done. It was, I'm at, that, it was at that point that Hunter knew. <laughs> he was not enjoying himself, and he was leaving. Yeah. Right off the tongue. So, 
That was grand. a whole ordeal. It was you. fun. It was a fun time though. I'm definitely going back next year. Yeah, yeah. You gonna go next year? You I don't. Go. My go. My go. Bryce uh, said that he was like wanting to go to Rooster Tea. RTX. Yeah. I was gonna say that, but I don't even watch Rooster Tea. I know that. <laughs> I'm just better at having things on the tip of my tongue. <laughs> Yes, probably. But I was also going to say Rooster Teeth Convention, RTX, is what I was going for. Well, I beat you. And now I sound more credible. That's fine. Be more credible <laughs> then. I don't care. Be more incredible. What? It, be. You're incredible, Hunter. <laughs> you're, you're just an incredible person. I love hanging out with you. <laughs> it's a great oh, day. Man. Well, we got the the big key, and we're going back in the same room oh, for some reason. Oh, I took the wrong turn at Albuquerque. <laughs> <laughs> you got the compass though, right? Yeah. So we can find our way to the the big baddie. We Make our way to the smoking crown. And we can finally get out of here. And then it's Master Sword next, I believe, right? I think. I said that very com confidently last time we played. And then <laughs> I was like, watching the video, like, I'm not 100% on that. What if I'm wrong? As much as we've stumbled through this game, we've helped some, some people. Though. Yeah. <laughs> We helped the uh, old Daniel. Old damn Daniel. Daniel. Yeah. That was so the, interesting to hear. Dan I was like, Danimal. what? <laughs> Someone actually used our Let's Play as, like, help? It was so... Because our Let's Plays need help. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We just go back a few episodes to trying to figure out equipping the bomb arrows. <laughs> <laughs> he was like, I don't know how to equip the bomb arrows. And I was like, well, we learned, so... <laughs> I don't know. You have to pause it first, everyone. You have to pause it first. That's, yeah, that would be nice if that was just stated. I just, like, everything takes place not paused. Like, this never happens, except for bomb arrows. And I'm like, ugh. And that's that's more the HD remake's fault than Twilight's. Because of the whole gamepad thing going on. Yeah, but it still annoyed me. Hug, take it out! Oh, no! I'm gyroing too hard. Lead? <laughs> All right. <laughs> well, while we're here, right? Oh, uh, you might as well. <sighs> Just okay. go for it. All right. All right. All right. All right. <laughs> all right. All right. All right. <laughs> uh, didn't it didn't work. <laughs> oh, was it over? It was over the thing. Yeah. Dang. I suck. It was over the thing. Yeah. Not a good go there. You all right? Uh, just looking at all that corn. <laughs> just drift me onto it. Oh, is that a thing? I don't think you're gonna get close enough. To oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you could have almost pulled it off. Could have almost. Maybe. Could've almost. If I was higher up, I could have done it. Yeah. Now I, I really want to go for the trick shot. Go for the trick shot. I'm thinking about it. Go 360 it. no scope. Wait for it. Huh? Oh no! Hold on. Wait. Most I got accurate. this. It'd be hilarious if the game kept record of the accuracy Dang with it. all your different shots and claw shot you have a decimal accuracy. <laughs> Nailed. There you go. I wanted to do it with those other things, but they weren't there. Yeah. You son! You son! Ah. <laughs> uh, do we just wait for it? It's looking. This is trash. <laughs> you freaking curling up. <laughs> Look like you were trying to show someone where the beach is. <laughs> I gonna wanna go. It's <laughs> that way. <laughs> Flex it. Here it is, here it is. Uh, first try. Nailing it. How many tries was that? First One, try. right? Yeah. Check the footage. Check the footage. Speaking of footage.